Okay, finally, I'd like to show you how to make a graph with two data series. So we have the engineering degree here and we have the IT degree here. I'd like to plot them against the year as we did before. So we select both of them and this time we're going to make a line chart. So we're going, we could make a column chart, just use clustered column as we did before. But this time we'll make a line chart. Now I have a few choices. Line will give us a, a line without any marks, but I'd like a marked line, so I'm going to use the marked line. All right. So here we have the graph output, and we have a legend here. Now this is actually important now, isn't it? Because we need to know the difference between the engineering degree and the IT degree. Uh, they're quite different. Again, we want to make the year the x-axis, so we'll do what we did before, select data, and we'll go to x-axis labels and select them, exactly the same way as we did before. Notice we have two series here now. Press OK. We want to, again, we want to add our axis titles. Title below axis gives us what we want. And for the vertical axis, we're going to use rotated. And this time we're going to call it enrollments because the enrollments are for the engineering degree in blue and the IT degree in red. So we can't say, as we did before, enrollments for the engineering degree. Notice the axis goes up to 3,500 this time because we've got a big number here. All right, now there's a lot of empty space here and we've got a lot of stuff squashed up here. This bit more and make the whole thing a bit smaller. Move this around a bit and we end up with the legend, I've just stuck that in the empty space, it doesn't have to go there, sometimes it can go at the top, it can go in various places. Now this is a little bit squished here, so we want to give it a bit more space. And finally, we want to save as picture and export as a PDF file. Okay, so that's how to make a graph with two data series on the one graph. Now I'm going to do it one more time, and this time I'm going to use a stacked column. So this is interesting because it shows you the total of the two, but it shows you also the proportion of each of those that make it up. We can only really say, see that they're about half and half can't really see much detail um, but we may only want really the total of the two degrees for the entire faculty of engineering and IT so that's another way of making a graph for a different purpose um, there's various ways of making graphs and you should try them all out thanks very much